Yeah. Okay. So I study, I study this exactly, uh, fibrotic diseases. Uh, and uh, so another example of that is liver cirrhosis. A lot of people have heard of liver cirrhosis. End stage heart failure is often caused by progressive scar tissue. Mm-hmm. Um, and so the, the same thing is happening. Like when you lose blood flow to your heart, we can easily medically open, open up that uh, blood flow again with a stent get blood flow back to your heart, but where you have that scar, that uh, myocardial infarction, that scarred area, the problem there is that it continues to grow. And that, and, and so, uh, so your heart is continuing to remodel. So as you get more scar tissue, contractile cells over here, your heart's expanding over here. And, and so your heart is always, you know, it's, your heart is remodeling yeah. as this process progresses until you ultimately have end stage heart failure. Um, I study a, a disease, a rare disease, where it's the most fatal and progressive disease of scar tissue, which happens in the lungs. Yeah. So basically, when you're relatively young, it sounds like you can get scarring in any tissue. When the, when everything is working you know, as it should, you will get very close to recapitulating the anatomic and just biophysical and spatial. You, you'll recapitulate the tissue as it was, and you'll have very little physical difference there. But as we age, this, the, the repair process starts to break down itself. And then you have scar tissue, say in a, in your heart or your liver, wherever, and it might be kind of close to the way the tissue was before, but not quite. And then maybe you start layering on more scar tissue on top of it. And that's just sort of physically, physically, anatomically, just changing things, pushing against cells, not allowing the blood to flow through the tube right. quite as much, like all, all of that stuff. Yeah, exactly. And keep in mind too, like each organ has a different capacity for turnover and repair. Like obviously right. skin has has a better capacity to turn this over than heart, right? So mm-hmm. inherently different tissues have different capacity for turnover and repair. But in general, that process tends to be less and less and less efficient as we age.